Walking is a great form of exercise with many health benefits, but choosing the appropriate shoes is essential for staying comfortable and injury-free. To help you narrow down your choices, here are top 5 best walking shoes of 2024 for you today. You can buy it at the link in the description below the video. Number 5. Hoka 1 1 Clifton 9 the Clifton 9 is a highly cushioned daily trainer with a rockered ride that will meet your needs as a runner. The Clifton 9 is highly stable and feels efficient over long distances. The Clifton 9 is lighter than ever before, at 7.3 ounces for women's pairs and 8.7 ounces for men. In addition to reducing weight, the brand increased stack height 3mm for women's sizes and 5mm for men's sizes to help create a more cushioned underfoot experience. The midsole is constructed of Hoka's Simiva foam. On a run, the Clifton 9 cushioning feels padded and well cushioned. You don't feel the ground, and there is enough of protection. Running at a slow to steady speed makes your feet feel like they're being helped along, and it relieves a lot of stress on the lower leg muscles. The midsole walls also extend across the sides of your foot. While you might imagine that the width and more support increase weight, the midsole feels quite light. The rubber still grips well, but it hasn't taken as much abuse. It handles the miles better than prior versions. The pattern is slightly different, but not by much, and the true improvement appears to be the rubber composition itself. It will withstand a great deal of wear and tear. The redesigned lasting and insole have marginally reduced the impression of step-in softness. The Clifton 9 features a revised footbed as well as a modified lasting that is not foam. This is the first Clifton that does not feature a perforated foam lasting. Obviously, these improvements lessen the amount of squish underfoot. The shoe's lightweight and breathable upper is a pleasant feature. The top is highly padded around the heel and ankle, and the recessed heel cup provides excellent retention. The top isn't particularly distinctive, but it's comfy and functional. Some runners feel that Hoka running shoes fit well around the sides. This is mainly due to the fact that the midsole walls wrap around the feet. If you desire additional toe box space, the Hoka Clifton 9 comes in a wide fit. Number 4. Saucony Ride 17 The Saucony Ride 17 series provides a well-balanced ride appropriate for a variety of runs, including long training sessions, recovery jogs, and dog walks around the park. The Ride 17 now weighs 10.1 ounce, 286 gram, a significant increase of 1.3 ounce, 37 gram, from the Ride 16. It has an additional 2 mm of stack height. It now measures 37 mm in the heel and 29 mm in the forefoot. Version 17 features a more current ride than version 16 thanks to an updated PR Run Plus midsole. It successfully balances providing appropriate cushioning for slower, easy runs while also maintaining a lively feel that lends itself well to quicker running. Transitioning from the midfoot to the forefoot is also exceptionally fluid and Saucony has added a hint of rocker geometry to the forefoot, making it easier to move forward. Thick, firm rubber covers the foam on the outsole, which has more rubber than the Ride 16. Prun Plus is also a robust foam, so it won't wear out quickly. This is undoubtedly one of the most durable daily trainer outsoles on the market. The Ride 17 retains a thick, detachable insole constructed of Piba Waruen plies. This adds even more cushioning and comfort immediately under your feet, giving it a plusher, more sumptuous sensation than the Enderfin Speed, which lacks it. The new upper does an excellent job of being comfortable, with enough flex to make the shoe seem malleable and unconstrained while also being robust and supportive, with no slipping or undesired slackness. There's also a stretchy, gusseted tongue with just the right amount of padding. Not too plush, but enough to keep you comfortable for several kilometers. The Ride 17, like other Saucony running shoes, runs true to size. The toe box isn't exceptionally tiny or large, with a regular feeling width, but there's enough room to make these shoes excellent choice for lengthy distances. Number 3. Asics Nova Blast 4 The Asics Nova Blast 4 is a daily trainer with maximum cushioning that can handle everything from mild runs to faster attempts. It's a versatile option that may be worn for a variety of running activities. The Nova Blast 4 weights 9.2 ounces, 260 grams, 
which is slightly more than the Nova Blast 3. There is also an additional 0.5mm of stack height in the heel and forefoot, bringing the total to 41.5mm or 33.5mm. It's a great gradual drop for the Achilles. They did this thanks to their revolutionary FF Blast Plus Eco Cushioning in the midsole. It provides a sensation of stability while also responding to the ground with each foot impact. It makes you feel more bouncy or explosive in a way. So they're ideal for not only relaxing days and lengthy runs, but also moderate paced exercises such as tempos. Another significant improvement is a new trampoline-inspired outsole for maximum bounce. It has also been given more grip, allowing it to handle a wider range of surfaces. The insole is easily removable because it is not glued, and because the midsole and top are standard sizes. Fitting insoles from other shoes or custom orthotics will be a breeze. The Nova Blast 4's upper is now made of a thin, woven cloth that feels more premium and fits the foot better than prior Nova Blasts. The heel cup is very deep and, when combined with some sidewalls on the heel, feels very supportive and gives excellent lockdown. The tongue remains flat and gusseted, but it has a tiny layer of padding in the center that feels more comfortable on the tops of the feet. The Asics Nova Blast 4 provides plenty of width in the forefoot and heel to fit a wide range of foot types. Number 2. Brooks Ghost 15 the Brooks Ghost 15 is a neutral running shoe that is suitable for distance running, everyday runs, and walking. The shoe features a 12mm drop on the upper end and weighs 9.1 ounces. While the maker suggests this shoe for road running, I've found it to be an excellent choice for treadmill running as well. The Ghost 15 is intended for neutral runners, offering a balanced combination of cushioning and support to those with a typical stride. The Ghost 15 relies heavily on its midsole. It's comprised of DNA Loft V2 cushioning, which combines rubber, air, and foam for a luxurious but lightweight sensation. Every step seems like you're walking on clouds. They are that comfortable. It doesn't hurt that the shoes include a padded heel collar and tongue, which contributes to their overall cloud-like comfort. The Ghost 15 features a segmented crash pad in the outsole. This design smooths your heel-to-toe transition and adapts to various foot strikes, resulting in a steady and smooth ride. The outsole is comprised of durable rubber with an increased traction pattern which provides grip and stability on a variety of surfaces. The Ghost 15's insoles are thin but molded, adding somewhat more support to an already stable shape. Best of all, they're removable, so if they start to stink, you can air them out or even wash them before reinstalling. The upper of the Ghost 15 is composed of engineered mesh, which is breathable and helps to keep your feet cool and comfy during runs. The mesh material offers both breathability and flexibility. Number 1. New Balance 860 V13 The Fresh Foam X860 is New Balance's daily trainer for individuals who want mild to moderate stability support, and version 13 is almost entirely new, with improvements that give this classic New Balance shoe a fresh look and improved performance. The New Balance 860 V13 boasts a 27mm heel and a 17mm forefoot, with a 10mm offset they've reduced the weight significantly. The men's model weighs 309 grams for a size 9.5. In the women's model, the size 7.5 weighs 243 grams. The 860 V13 features a revised Fresh Foam X midsole for softer, more protective landings and a bouncy energy return. The midsole's medial post has also been re-engineered with revised shape, allowing the 860 to provide consistent support while allowing for smooth, unencumbered transitions from heel to toe. Along with the midsole, the 860 V13 includes an improved rubber outsole and a redesigned engineered mesh upper, which help cater to individuals who require extra stability while providing the top-notch durability and comfort that runners demand from this well-known everyday trainer. The upper was built of air mesh last year, but it has been changed this year to engineered mesh. The heel counter ensures a secure fit and contributes to the shoe's stability. The flared heel collar makes the shoes simpler to slip on and supports your Achilles. 